so welcome to this week's vlog. Um, this is me from the future realizing I didn't actually do an introduction. So um, in this week's vlog, we've got a little bit of this and a little bit of that and uh, some out of the ordinary stuff that you might not think you could find in Las Vegas. So let's jump into this vlog and I'll catch up with you at the end. Got a couple of little ducks. I don't know what that little is that a baby pheasant? I don't know. Two little baby pheasants. I think that's a female pheasant. Not pheasant, peacock. What am I talking about? I think that's a female peacock and two little baby peacocks. And then this barn here homes rabbits, but because it's so hot, they've closed it for the day. Hmm, fig jelly for $8. That sounds quite good. Mixed berry, ruby red grapefruit. Want to touch it? No. Oh. You. Oh, do it. On the nose, that's it. Ew, look at her nose. Oh. All right. Hello. Oh, shit. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, all right. <laughs> that's a donkey. Oh. There's another baby one. I think it's called the Shrek. I just think it's like donkey. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is a nice one. Oh. What is that? What the heck? What the heck? What is that? I don't know. It says it's a picture of a chicken and just says eggs. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Hello, pretty. Hello, darling. Oh, you're lovely. Look at your eyes. Oh. Oh, there goes the other cow. Oh, that is a cow. Oh, yeah. Because yeah, that one. Hello. Hello. One of my favorite animals, goats. Oh, sorry. Oh, this little camel coloured one. Oh, you're gorgeous. You're lovely. Okay, now what kind of fun? See, better than getting bit. Feeding time at the zoo. Hello, darling. Hello, sausage. I haven't got anything for no, you we, though. We Sorry. Can find something. I, I've got, I they got a little train that's not open today because of the heat, obviously. But I'm gonna make my brown eyes blue. to the thrift store just to have a look around just to have a nose there's not anything really in particular that i'm looking for i thought i'd just get out of the house for a bit go have a nose but i'm telling you there is very little parking left in this uh thrift store it's absolutely heaving with people so uh, it'd be interesting to see what's in there they do have an interesting array of pots here but i think i've got enough for the moment so i'm gonna leave these for someone else really like this but it's petite petite hmm I would have bought that had it been in my size okay I found one little top I'll show you when I get in the car so I found this little knitted sweater it's got short sleeves like a t-shirt and a little crew neck but it's in this pretty oatmeal color and it was six dollars 
I thought this would be nice. I'm starting to look for autumn stuff now, so yeah. Happy with that little find. Oh, I need to turn this off because I need to crank up the air. So from the thrift store, I bought these shorts from the loft and they were $6. And I tried them on, they fit perfectly. Yep, very happy with those. You can sit up here if you want and then slide down the little slide. Yeah, look, you can sit up here with these little seats. That's the bathroom, isn't it? So I thought we're returning something back to Amazon. So whilst he's making his return, I thought I'd go and have a look around Coles. I'm inside Coles now and it looks like autumn's arrived. This is a really cute little outfit, isn't it? Hmm, I like that. Let's see how much the shirt is. Let's see. It is $40. Yeah, that's cute, nice colour. I even like this simple t-shirt. I just like this colour. $30. Yeah, pretty. Autumn has arrived. It's a cute little top, isn't it? And this is thirty-four ninety-nine. Mm. Oh, they got it in blue. Oh, that's really nice. That's have a look. Same price. Yep, yeah, that's cute. So same material, just in a skirt. Oh, I like that color, that burgundy. $29.99. Oh, the husband's arrived. <laughs> My shopping's over with. <laughs> so we've come out to this farmer's market on the west side of Vegas and actually it's quite a big one. Um, but it's so incredibly hot. I have to video in tiny little snippets because my phone keeps overheating. Let me give you a little overview of the farmer's market. of this oh this jug it's uh for forty dollars that's really pretty really pretty oh that's some good inspiration there this appears to be like a little cowboy themed area here the little tin cups around the fire Oh, look at that. Lovely. Some nice blankets. This is really unique. It's a resin side table. Um, so that's $1,000. Look, they've encased a piece of wood inside. Oh, that's really different. Cute little florals. those ones oh I like these cushions oh they're so soft $20 oh those are pretty I've got a little mushroom up there 
No, I like this one. It's different. Okay, what is this? Handmade terracotta. I think it's just a pot, isn't it? Oh my gosh, it's heavy. That is pretty though. That is pretty. Peacock. There's a lot of horses. Oh, that's different. I like the simplicity of this one. This is actually China with this painted on. $60. That's cute. I do like these benches. I need a bigger house for everything I like. <laughs> these bookends are actually quite cute. Let's see how much these are. $12.99. That's a good price. Okay, I'm in Bath and Body Works and I wanted to share with you the line that I need to use. It's eucalyptus and spearmint. Is it spearmint? I've had no spearmint. Um, I have it in the candle. I have it in the room spray. Um, the lotion, the oil. Um, I see they've got something new here. You put this in the shower. I've not seen this before. Revitalizing clay mask, uh, daily face cream, daily face wash, and these are $5.95. Now I did pick up one candle from Bath and Body Works. This is my favorite. It's the stress relief one. It's a three wick candle. And I could have sworn I used to pay $25 for these, but it was $13.95. Maybe my memory's wrong, but I could have sworn it was more expensive than this. So I was really happy, $13.95. It smells amazing. It is um, eucalyptus and spearmint. Mm. But in this range, I also have the ring spray and the material like the bed linen spray. I also have, um, gosh, what was it? What are those little incense sticks? Now, I bought those from the Dollar Tree and they're actually really quite good. Um, the eucalyptus ones. I've used them all up and I'm, I'm burning a Tonka one this morning, which I don't like. My daughter liked it, but I don't like that one, but I'm burning it anyway. So anyway, that's my little stash of eucalyptus, my nice little stress relief, my little spa scent. Um, I like to get the whole house filled with that scent. So, you know, having four dogs, you can't help but sometimes think that your house smells of dogs, but um, I think I've got enough here to cover up that smell. So I'm currently editing the video that you just watched and I wanted to jump on here and share with you a couple of items that I found at the thrift store. I've went twice I think this week or maybe even three times this week and I found so many good items for the grandchildren, mainly clothes um, oh, and a couple of books. But the clothes that I found still had store tags on so I'm really pleased with this. So I found this little sweatshirt, it was $5 and it was from Philosophy, I don't know. Well, that is but it's a very thin knit and I thought this would look cute with a pair of jeans and a white t-shirt underneath so I'm very happy with that I also found a Ralph Ralph Lauren top for my daughter I found this little top it was three dollars I don't think this was anything time true yeah I don't know what brand that is but it's just a little gray and white stripy top be good for autumn um i found books for the grandchildren i oh yeah mainly clothes i didn't pick up any toys did i no there was no toys um but yeah very happy with my finds this week in goodwill and um and that farm that i went to you know i've driven past that farm so many times and never realized how big it is inside my daughter bought some honey and it was a really good purchase because it was a big i think a 20 ounce jar and she paid ten dollars for it and so we are gonna go back there. Just, it's free to go in the shop, but if you wanna go see the farm animals, I think for all of us, for myself, my daughter, my two grandchildren, I think it was about $32.
or $30 and then we bought $2 worth of uh, food to feed the goats with. But yeah, it was so much fun to go, but it was so hot. So today it's 93 degrees, so thankfully it's now coming down in temperature. I really hope it doesn't go back up a over 100, which sometimes it does in September, but hopefully this year it won't. So anyway, I want to say thank you for watching this uh, vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. There's some different things to see other than just casinos in Las Vegas. Uh, consider subscribing if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate that. Or give me a thumbs up or send me an emoji. Uh, thanks so much. I'll see you in a couple of days on Sunday where we've got a really fun video, this one. And uh, if you don't know what Sundays are all about, it's a collaboration that I've been doing for the last 18 months with the Transatlantic Housewives of YouTube. That's Tina, Maria and Karen. And we'll see you on Sunday at 7.30. Thanks so much and I'll see you soon. Bye!